operating in some 79 countries, audit, accounting and consulting firm Mazars is integrated globally. In the Asia-Pacific, Hong Kong is increasingly a center for Belt and Road-related client business. Mazars Hong Kong, I would say, is a hub for the Great China and also at the same time we are coordinating the capital market activities, in particular the IPO in the region. We have around 20 plus listed companies in Hong Kong and also based on our experience and our past history, we are quite very strong in helping companies raising money in the capital market. Belt and Road is a kind of win-win situation and we are going to capture this opportunity. Mazars is particularly focused on technology clients and often follows up on large infrastructure programs that create a new prosperity in China and other Belt and Road countries. For Belt and Road, other than infrastructure, there is also a lot of opportunity for the technology company and for the development of fintech and also for those uh, company providing service consulting. There's a lot of this kind of opportunity. There may be, I would say, are being missed by the market. If they go to the equity market, then Hong Kong would be the great place because in terms of our valuations, our liquidities, and also, I would say, the source of our investor. Indeed, recently, Mazars managed an initial public offering in Hong Kong for Singapore-based Nesion Technologies in a highly trend-driven area. It's a technology company providing cyber infrastructure uh, solutions and also cyber security solutions. The reason that why we uh, being, uh, uh, we say, work with the company on this project and then take the project to Hong Kong uh, to be listed in the growth enterprise market of Hong Kong Stock Exchange. Mazar sees large numbers of companies related to Belt and Road countries lining up for Hong Kong listings. There is a lot of, we say, Belt and Road company have already made their applications, in particular for those projects in ASEAN country. So it is a trend. As a French headquartered firm, Mazars expects numerous opportunities to arise. There is many countries which is French speaking, for example Vietnam and also many countries in Africa. It is our competitive advantage. Mazars also expects new Belt and Road opportunities appearing through a specialised project financing arm in Australia and linked also to Hong Kong's role as a treasury centre for the Belt and Road. The one side is financing. We can see the Hong Kong government is introducing a lot of tax incentives for those uh, headquarters to obtain financing in Hong Kong and then finance the project in Belt and Road. But at the same time, uh, we're talking about Treasury is how we invest the company's surplus cash. In Hong Kong, not only the financing channel, we have a very good investing channel. So I can see there is a huge, I would say, opportunity and success of our Hong Kong Treasury Center policy.